On this video, I'm gonna show you how to use Kahoot to play live game on Virtual Classroom. Hola mga Leakers! Welcome back! If you're new to my channel, my name is Sir Kevin and I love to share my knowledge and skills about educational technology. I upload my videos almost every day. So if you want to learn more about educational technology, Subscribe now and hit that notification bell so you will be updated on my latest video. In your browser, open Kahoot and Google Classroom. Let's start with your Kahoot first. Make sure the quiz is ready to play. Once logged in, click Kahoot's tab. Choose the quiz game, then click play. Choose teach. You have game options below for configuration. Just toggle any options you like for your game. For example, if you want to move from one question to another automatically, just turn on this automatically move through questions. Once done, choose game mode. Choose classic if you want individual player compete to one another. Choose team if you want a group competition. For this demonstration, let me choose classic. Now, we are ready to invite our students. In your Google Classroom, click the Google Meet link. A new tab opens for Google Meet. Set up first your microphone and camera. If it's your first time to use Google Meet, click the caption above for basic guide. Then, click Join Meeting. If your students using their personal account, provide them the link of your meeting by posting it to your stream. Just click Admit to give them permission to join. Once you're complete, click present now and choose a Chrome tab. Then, locate your Kahoot. If they are using the web, they need to open a browser and type in www.kahoot.it and copy the game pin. On their Kahoot app, just type in the game pin and they're done. Note that they are required to give their nickname for the game. On the game options previously, you can also turn on friendly nickname to avoid of course any nickname that is unpleasant or improper for the game the name of your students appears on this area let your students join until you are complete then click start on your screen flashes the questions while on your students are the options with the various shapes and colors corresponding to the question given players earn points for every correct answer and no point for incorrect answer. Which player got the highest points win the game and rank as number one. After a game, students give feedbacks which are sent back to the teachers. Once done, click stop button to end your screen sharing. Then, you can continue the video meeting with your students. Piece of advice, Make sure all of your students left the video conference before you close it. Making sure you are the last person leaving the conference room. Go back again to your Google Classroom. On the settings, reset the link and turn off the visibility. In this way, no one of your students reused the link and rejoined the meeting without your knowledge. If this video helps you a lot, give a like and share to the people you think who needs to see it. Once again, I am Sir Kevin. Thank you for watching. See you on my next video. To know more about Kahoot, click one of the videos you are most interested in.